So I'm at the vineyard and I'm doing some replanting of grapevines because some have died. So down at the bottom of these rows where it's lower, you tend to see a bit more mortality. And there we have one that has died. So what I'm going to show you is uh, my process for re replanting. Okay. So, the first order of business is to remove the existing colors in the, uh, the landscape fabric that's at the bottom. There's these sticks that never come off. Uh, and I take the stick out, move it to the side. I take my bulb planter, this is a Lee Valley bulb planter, very high quality best ones I've used so far. One of the features that makes it very nice is that it's tapered. It's smaller on this side, larger on this side, so that when you take a core of earth and you want to get it out of your bulb planter, it'll come out easily because this side is larger. A lot of these bulb planters are your uniform cylinder. That's a bad idea. This is a good idea. There are some additional sort of uh, um, design features at the bottom that uh, possibly also make it quite good. I haven't really thought about them too much. So, next step is to take a core. And what I'm looking for is to get a good core. And I've got a good core there. The, uh, the bulb planter went down quite far. I pull it up. See these handles? They're great for pulling. And I take it out, and I take the core out, put it beside the hole, because I'm going to reuse that core. Um, if I were to push down and the bulb planter stopped there, I couldn't go any further, then I would uh, move, I'd take that core out, put it back in, and move down to where I can get a good core. So now that I have the hole ready, I will get a plant. So here is a rooted plant that I got started in my greenhouse and what I do first is put some of this material back in the hole that I've used to transport it here with. Then I start adding this clay gently and then I add a little bit more clay and uh, doesn't hurt to add a little bit of the compost that I use for transporting it here. The next step is to take the landscape fabric that I use to mulch down the weeds. I put that around the, around the plant. Take this, put this back in place here to train the vine. And then I take the other piece of landscape fabric cut like that. Generally you need two layers to get uh, lands to mulch down grass and weeds and stuff so that's why we go with two. Now that I've got that I take my guard and put it around the plant and then I find my stakes that I took out. Grab it here, I put pressure down on the guard and then I do a quick snap so I don't uh, bend the landscape fabric. Again, I take it on this side, put it tight, hold this, this down and snap it into place. I hit a rock there and maybe I'll try over here. There we go. Push it down and there we go. Ready to go.